This is the Lock Picking Lawyer. I'm coming to you today with a public service announcement. What you see in front of you is the control panel for a Harbor Freight safe, or at least what they sell as safes. In fact, it's ridiculously easy to get into. Now, most people look at these, they see a nice heavy metal box, and they think it offers some level of security. And that's actually not true. Getting into these is quite simple, and let me show you how. Behind this panel here is the mechanical backup to the electronic lock, and it is a tubular, tubular lock, and it's about as cheap as they come. Um, there's a lot of ways to get into these locks. You can single pin pick them, you can impression them. I am going to use a very cheap $10 tool you can order from most Chinese websites like DHgate. Looks a little bit like this. They come for, I think it was about 30 bucks for a set of three of these um, in three different sizes. And what they're designed to do is allow you to impression a lock like this with little or no skill. You simply put it in and then move it from side to side and it's open. And then the really nasty part about this is is that you now have the key code right on that tool. You can actually go out and make your own key to the safe now with the information on here. I can also just stick that right back in, lock it up, and no one will ever know that I was in your safe. So this is my public service announcement. Stay away from these Harbor Freight safes. Unless you just buy it as a metal box and you plan to do something like weld a hasp and a good lock onto it. In which case, uh, maybe it's a good deal for you. Other than that, stay away. If you have any comments, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day.